Travis Frederick, sandwiched between the Cowboys' two other All-Pros on the offensive line, is becoming the center of attention for more than his play on the football field. Recently, we got a chance to see his softer side. Nothing makes All-Pro center Travis Frederick happier than paving the way for Ezekiel Elliott. But Zeke's not the only one Travis wants to see fed over and over again. Uh, the thought of uh, a kid going to school hungry and hearing the statistics, one in four children in Dallas are hungry. It gives you no opportunity to be successful in life. And so what we want to do is help provide opportunity. That Travis is tackling the dilemma through his Blocking Out Hunger Foundation and by teaming up with Tango Tag, a free app that donates the cost of a meal to a local pantry every time you eat at a participating restaurant. When you don't feed a child, they can't learn. So effectively, we're causing a future generation to fail. And that's our failure. Failure is not an option for Frederick when he looks at his wife, Kaylee, and their 13-month-old son, Oliver. We're so fortunate to be in the position that we are and, and to be have a healthy family. And there's so many people that aren't quite as fortunate. A lot of things he does, he donates his time, his money. He says, just don't tell anybody about it because that's not that important to him. It's just the fact that people are getting what they need is the most important part. And he's inspiring so many others to lend a helping hand. Just take a look at all these sandwiches. More than anyone can count. But think, they'll all be distributed within a few days. And more will be needed. More than anyone can imagine. To see the need and, and to know that it's right here in the backyard of Dallas, one of the wealthiest areas around, um, but also one of the hungriest. Hopefully we can make a way. If Travis Frederick has his way, soon no one's plate will be empty. You know, that event was held at Gordon Biersch on Park Lane in Dallas. Yeah. They made almost 15,000 sandwiches that day. Wow. And I think what Travis said holds so true that it's so hard to wrap your mind around the fact that in such a great area to live and a relatively affluent area, how does hunger like that exist? But the reality is, is that it does. The numbers are really shocking. Yeah. One and four. He kept saying wow. one and four. All right. Great. Way to go, Travis. Great to shine a light on that. Keith, thank you so much. Thank you, Keith. We'll be right back.